God. Oh my God, we're doing it. We're do- Guys! No! 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 Hey, what is up everybody? I'm Star Lord, and today I'm going to be showing you guys what happens when you get over 50 points on your high score in one of the arcade games in Pokemon Brick Bronze. It is seriously awesome guys, and uh, I know some of you guys are going to love it. I know some people may already know about this also, but this guide is kind of for those of you who don't. Uh, but before we get into the video guys, don't forget to leave a like as it does help me out more than you would realize, and uh, let's get into today's guide guys. So here we are in Antion City, and uh, what we're going to do is we're gonna get on our hoverboard and go towards this entranceway right here and uh, once we've done that and we've came out the other end just like so we're gonna turn around and take our first left down here to the housing district is that housing yeah it's pretty sure it said housing district I'm pretty sure it did anyway uh, and once we were here guys yes it did okay once we're here we actually want to go down towards the museum and turn left on this last piece of bridge right here and uh, then you'll see the golden pokeball which is like some big huge hotel kind of thing I guess uh, we want to go inside there and we want to go to the right hand side in which then we will see the arcade itself like we see right here you know uh, and once we're inside guys this is what we're going to do. We're going to go uh, to this little mini game right here on the right hand side. And uh, a lot of you guys are really going to like this mini game because it actually is, it's Flappy Bird, but with Rowlets. And I've got to be honest, I'm pretty terrible at this. I'm I was nowhere near the exit. <laughs> so what you guys want to do is once you're on this game, it's going to take a while for some of you, especially those on mobile. Oh my god, because I hear this is really laggy on mobile. Uh, but for those of you who are on PC, well done to you. You may actually be able to do this. And um, what we need to do is we need to get over 50 in the Rowlet uh, kind of, I, I don't know why they never called it Rowlet Jump or something like that, or Flappy Rowlet. I, I guess it doesn't ring off, you know, it's it's not as like kind of good with the with the sliding off the tongue, but it sounds pretty legit, you know? Uh, let's see, come on. Can we at least be two? Yes, we be two. No! I keep on hitting that little top corner of the executor's hair. Why? I'm so terrible. Let's try another go. Go on. Please. Well, anyway, once you've actually done 50 of these, like, you, you, you've you actually beat it, like, through 50 times. You've went through 50... 50 executors. You will actually be prompted with a very awesome board. Now, of course, you guys saw the board that I was on. This is the Salamance board. And uh, you can actually buy it from the guy over here, this, this dude right here. If you just scroll down, you'll see Mega Salamance board. But what is really cool is that if you do get over 50 in that awesome, awesome minigame over there, you will actually get a shiny Mega Salamence board. And it looks so, so cool. I'm just trying to see if any of my friends are on who have it right now because I still don't have it. I still don't have it. And I really want to get it. I really want to get it. Like, I was nowhere near that. Seriously? Come on. Please. I really just want to get the high score on this game. I want to like get a 50. Like my friends are getting like 80 and everything and I'm here. I can't even get two. I can't even get two. Oh, why am I so terrible at these type of games? I was never good at Flappy Birds anyway. Like I genuinely dislike Flappy Birds. I mean, it was good, but I disliked it because I was terrible at it, you know? Um, well, anyway, guys. That is pretty much being it for today's guides because I'm going to throw my mouse at the screen. That is doing my head in. Uh, okay, so yeah, guys, like I said, that is pretty much being it for today's guide. I do hope that you enjoyed it. it I know it was very small, you know, it, well, it didn't really go on that long, but, you know, it's it's whatever. And uh, tomorrow or later on today, I'm actually going to have a glitch guide or a glitch video on all of the glitches that you can do inside the arcade uh, for any of you that, like, want to do glitches. Because I know that I never recorded the house glitch on Frostvale, and everybody tweets me about it and messages me about it every day now just because I haven't recorded it But I found it like within the first like day and just because I never recorded it Everyone thinks I don't know about it So what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna record a couple of my glitches that I know and uh, yeah 
Oh my god. Oh my god. We're doing it. We're do- Guys! No! 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 Guys, thank you very much for watching, and until next time, I've been Starlord. <laughs> Damn you, Flappy Rowlet. Oh, see ya.